If someone says they're a data scientist, what do you think they do? Maybe machine learning, data mining, statistical analysis, creating reports, acquiring and processing data, data modeling? It seems like the title of data scientist is all over the place. So why don't we stop using it? Let's start by looking at our older sibling, computer science. Have you ever met a computer scientist? I haven't. I've met software engineers, system administrators, security engineers, DevOps engineers, web devs, support specialists, and so on. That's because computer science is a field of study, understanding the theory of computation, automation, and information, and then the practical disciplines that stem from that science. And there are computer scientists, but they're the people who are researching the future of computing quantum computers, photonic computers, biological computers, and so on. They're mostly working in research labs and academia, not your everyday corporation. While the people who apply computer science are given the previously mentioned titles that correspond with the actual role they perform. And these titles aren't always perfect and accurate, but it's much easier to understand who to go to with the specific request or generally know what somebody does. It would be nice to see data science grow to a similar structure where data scientists focused on research into the future of data, like the academic side of things, R&D for AI, data ethics, data storage, and so on. While the jobs implementing the practical usage of data science have more specific titles to reflect their roles. Some of these titles have existed for a long time under the umbrella of computer science. We have the data analysts, integration engineers, backend developers, database developers, business intelligence, those have always been around and are usually grouped under IT. Or they're part of business teams like data analysts and business intelligence can be. But some roles have developed in the age of data science, like data engineers and machine learning engineers. So things have been naturally trending in this direction. And that's good not just because it helps know what someone's role is specifically, but a lot of times companies that don't know better hire a data scientist and expect them to do everything. Data collection, cleaning, ingestion, modeling, machine learning, analytics, and reporting. And then they're shocked when there's not much produced. By breaking out titles into roles based on what somebody actually delivers, it can help executives better understand staffing needs to achieve the goals. And most leadership already struggles enough when it comes to data when there are already descriptive roles and titles. Of course, this is all just food for thought. There's no way to push an entire industry to a nice standard. Even CS, which is more established, isn't always consistent, especially as technology rapidly changes and the need for roles comes and goes. But I do think it's interesting to consider how titles and roles can grow and mature the field, and the impact it has on staffing and our ability to produce data products. Another problem with the data science title is you feel like you have to know it all for the job, which can lead to some serious imposter syndrome. If you want to figure out how to deal with that, you'll want to watch this video for some tips.